Assalamu alaikum guys welcome back to my channel today I am back with another amazing video and uh, let's read the title of this video first so it is powerful power of TNI Indonesian National Armed Forces Military Review so uh, power of TNI TNI means Indonesian Armed Forces so I'm pretty excited to watch if you guys are new on my channel please make sure to give a like subscribe and press the bell icon and without wasting any more time let's watch now okay. hello everyone we are glad you joined us today because the topic we're going to speak about is the indonesian national armed forces the Indonesian National Armed Forces are the military forces of the Republic of Indonesia, consisting of the Army, Navy, and Air Force. The President of Indonesia is the Commander-in-Chief of the Armed Forces, initially formed with the name of the People's Security Army, or the TKR, then later changed to the Republic of Indonesia Army before changing again its name to the Indonesian National Armed Forces mm -hmm. to the present. The Indonesian Armed Forces would be formed during the Indonesian National Revolution when it undertook a guerrilla war along with mm. informal militia. As a result of this and the need to maintain internal security, the Armed Forces, including the Army, Navy, and Air Force, were organized along territorial lines aimed at defeating internal enemies of the state and potential external invaders. Mm -hmm. Oh, gunship helicopters. <clears throat> when it comes to the army, the Indonesian army is the land branch of the Indonesian National Armed Forces. Since the nation's independence movement, the Indonesian army has been involved in multifaceted operations, ranging from the incorporation of Western New Guinea, the Indonesia Malaysia confrontation, to the annexation of East Timor as well as internal counterinsurgency operations in Aceh, Maluku, and Papua. When it comes to military expenditures, it features a military budget of $8.05 billion, wow. while 1% GDP manpower includes active personnel of 395,000, with a reserve of 400,000, wow. and an available 52 million. This is martial arts. Land forces include 408 tanks with 1,249 AFVs, an artillery of 356, 141 self-propelled guns, and a rocket artillery of 86. Nice.
maritime strategic interests, as well as the islands surrounding Indonesia, and also to defend against seaborne threats. The Navy features a total naval fleet of 147, which includes 24 corvettes, 8 frigates, and 5 submarines. Look at the flag. It's waving. Wow. Missile or target target missile. The Air Forces. The Indonesian Air Force is the aerial branch of the Indonesian National Armed Forces. The Indonesian Air Force is headquartered in Jakarta, Indonesia, and is headed by the Chief of Staff of the Air Force. Its order of battle is split into three Air Force operational commands, and most of its air bases are located on the island of Java. The Indonesian Air Force also has its ground force unit called the Air Force Special Forces Corps. The Corps is also known as Orange Berets due to their distinctive color of their service headgear. In addition, while not part of the Air Force, most of the personnel of the Indonesian National Air Defense Forces Command are picked from the Air Force, and its commander is always an Air Force two-star marshal. Oh my god. Shot down a plane, I think. Look at the eyes, two eyes. Alright guys, so the video is over and in this video we saw power of uh, Indonesian Army, Indonesian Armed Forces. Uh, so we saw uh, Navy, we saw uh, you know ground forces and, uh, and the rest of the other army sectors. So everyone is expert and as, as the uh, you know speaker was saying that they combat in different internal, they, they, uh, they killed internal uh, militias uh, and so they were fighting the outsiders and the inside uh, inside of the country so some uh, yeah uh, I, I, I heard that there is a problem in uh, uh, Papua uh, province of Indonesia so uh, they are targeting uh, Papua's uh, militias and uh, rest of the other parts of the country they are where uh, the operation needed so uh, Indonesian army is uh, you know a professional army and uh, fully armed and uh, fully skilled army uh, so it was uh, a nice info uh, so I hope you like the info of this video so if you do please make sure to give a like subscribe and press the bell icon and you can suggest me more videos in the comment section so that's it for today see you next video till then goodbye have a great day